Hi everyone and welcome back to another video. I hope everyone is doing well today. Uh, as for me, I've kind of had a bit of a rough week. I don't know if it's from the weather changing and affecting my nerves really bad and kind of feeling a little stuffed up again. Because the other day I was sitting outside and it was like almost plus 20 and now today is very cold and snowing and it's Sunday afternoon. So hopefully the dogs aren't going to knock you over or destroy the place. It's kind of nap time at the moment. But let's get right into this Dollarama haul. I'm going to have a lot of hauls for you. This little Max came to say hi. Say hi. What? Say hi to the people. You can say hi to our friends. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's get this haul done. So first thing I'm going to show you, we needed some rubbing alcohol. It was $1.75. It was just uh, leaking there a little bit. So I did buy that. Uh, another item I got sitting here beside me was this big frame. And it was, uh, I believe it was $5. It is a 16 inch by 20 inch frame. So I did get that. Let's see if I can stand that up here. Out of the way. All right, maybe I should put it back where I had it. Let's put it back here. I don't, I don't think it's glass. I think it's plastic on it. It's like a, a plastic, yeah. Um, some Tostitos chips. I always just grab them there, $3. Uh, some Doritos, I believe that they were $3 as well. Uh, some Christmas items here. So, let me grab my glasses here. This says uh, 60 piece, but it doesn't look like 60 pieces in here. It was $1.50. It's little berry decorations. Well, I have a, a smaller tree in, in a stand and it was already lit and had these on it excuse me had these on it with some uh pine cones so we're just gonna freshen it up and add some more to it so that's what i bought those for uh cupcake cups and picks they had the red truck and it's a really pretty red plaid the red truck you get red truck and uh poinsettia picks so I thought that was cute. So it's 24 picks and 24 cupcake holders. I grabbed another one of the uh, garland because I think I'm going to use this up on my fireplace there again with the other one. We'll be using it somewhere, but anyway, it's it's quite long and it was uh, $4.50. But it's really pretty. It's just plastic, but it looks so real. There she is. That's all of it. Well, hello. So if you haven't watched my other video, we named the cats. So this is Onyx. And I was just looking underneath and I said to my husband, I think Onyx is a boy and Marble is a girl. So the boys, the guys didn't do a very good at job at the shop, did they? But that's okay, because we'll take us to the vet. That is okay. <laughs> so I got some cross stitch kits. This one, $1.50. This one's a Christmas tree. And I think I bought some more. I'll leave that sitting there. I did grab another one of those. Actually, are these different size? Yes, these ones are bigger than this one. So this one says 36 piece, that one says 60 piece. So we had two of those and they were both $1.50. Uh, let's see, did I have some more cross stitch in here? Yes, we'll have to we'll come across them when we come across them. We don't see them. Anyway, that one was the Christmas tree and it was $1.50. I believe I got one for the giveaway because I got to get, got to get organized and do a giveaway. I saw these canning jar gift sets. They were $2. So, um, it doesn't say how many you get. I'm assuming, oh, nine gift tags and nine gingham covers. So I went ahead and bought the green. And I bought the red. These are nice too if you're doing up a jar, you know, with uh, whatever you're putting in it for a Christmas gift. You know, if you want to do bath bombs, if you want to do those, uh, what do you call those chocolate bombs for the hot chocolate or cookie mix or whatever. These do make a nice finishing to the, uh, to the glass jar. So they were $2 each. What you doing there? Where's your sister? I also picked up this middle 
sorry, middle, metal <laughs> treetop star. It was $1.75. Because I don't think I have one for our little Star Wars tree. I can't remember what we put on the top of it. So that's what that one's for. I saw these towel sets. They're absolutely beautiful. It says, uh, we're really into Christmas. So you get the cotton towel and you get the little oven mitt. Really nice. That'd be a nice gift. So I don't know if I'm going to give it away or keep it. Um, it does say $5 on the back. Not sure if that's what I was charged. Dish towel. Yeah, they were $5. So I did get this one. Oh, and it says ho, 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 all the rubbery part on the back. It says ho, ho, ho. So I did get that one. I got this green one. Um, so it's just plain. The oven mitt, very pretty with the holly. And the uh, dish towel that came with this has uh, Twas the Night Before Christmas printed on it. So the whole saying all the way down to the end. So I thought that was a nice one too. So it was also $5. I don't want to open it up in case uh, I decide to give it as a gift. So those were $5 each. What you doing there? What you doing there? I bought some signs. I know I don't need them, but when you see them and you fall in love with them, you grab them. This one says, wish you a Merry Christmas. And that's metal up there. It sits out a bit. This one was $2.75. I like how it finished it off with the black and white uh, plaid. All right. We're not going to play with my stuff. Thank you. The other one I got was Joy to the World. So they put the, the metal part on the bottom of this one. So $2.75. <laughs> That's the two of them together. Very pretty. And we got this one. Welcome to our winter wonderland. Because I thought this one would be nice to leave out all winter. Again, with the little raised. You can see how much they lift, raise it up. Can you there? Yeah. That one was also $2.75. Not sure if I bought this one last year or not. But it does look familiar. We wish you a Merry Christmas. And this one was $1.50. And that's okay if I have another one because I got lots of places to decorate. Someone's trying to eat my bag of chips there. They had these, I believe, last year as well. And I picked up some more. This one's kind of more of a pinky red color, the little wooden tree. And uh, it was $2. And it's not very big. Like, yeah, there's my hand, so... It's not very big. Got that one. Oh, I bought two the same, so they were $2 each. Nice, perfect on a tiered tray. Oh, I bought, did this, is this another pack I bought? Yeah, I must have bought two packs. $1.75, I'll probably throw one in as a gift since I got two of them. Uh, what else did we buy that was Christmassy? They had this here. Very interested in this. It's a fabric roll. Uh, they were $4 each. This one is Christmas trees. We're actually going to open it up. And see what it's all about, eh, Max? Ooh, that's really nice. It's like a burlap uh, fabric. That's very pretty to craft with. Very pretty. So I did get that one. Really like that. That there will probably sell fast. Let's try to pack it back in here. Now does it say how much you get? It seems to be quite a bit in there. So approximate 4.2 inch by 78.7 inch. That's quite a bit of fabric there. And then I got this one. This one has a little bit of glitter in it. I think that's a pretty good deal for $4. Look at this one with the holly. Very, very pretty. You know, you could almost wrap a gift with this as well, and then they would have a nice piece of fabric. So, but that's the only two that I saw and I grabbed. Pretty sure that those will sell quite fast. You could throw that across the table as a runner as well. You could do lots of stuff with that. Line the back of, uh, you know, 
a frame or something that you want to craft with. Here we go. We got more of the, uh, so let's see, the cross stitch. So I did go ahead and buy two Christmas trees because one will go in a giveaway. And what else did I buy? I bought two off the snowman. So one for me, one for the giveaway. And two, oh, no, I only got one of these. This was the, uh, the little penguin. And this one was Santa. There might be another one down in the bottom of the bag. Santa. And they were $1.50 each. So that's a really good uh, little purchase. What can I do for you, my dear Max? Hey, what's the matter? What's the matter? Can I do my bowl, please? And then we'll we'll see what's, what's what with you guys. I went down the beauty aisle and these were um, soaps. Uh, this one is Orange Spice Luxury Soap. It's uh, by Ivy and Castle. And just look at the beautiful packaging. Now, how much were these? Soap, soap, soap. Christmas Bar of Soap. So they were $2.50 each. So we did get this one. Like I said, it's Orange Spice. The red truck here is Frosted uh, Pomegranate. Again, by uh, Ivy and Castle. They smell good. And then I got this one, Winter Mint. So these are going to be beautiful to give away as a gift. Like, they're just packaged really, really pretty. Uh, I got two of the... Uh, I bought two just because of the red truck. <laughs> so that was the uh, Frosted Pomegranate. And was there any more... No, nope, that was it. So yeah, I ended up, so there was four. And I think, uh, well, there's three, sorry, three different ones. I think that was the only three available. So I grabbed one of each and an extra one of the uh, the red truck picture. I didn't get it for the scent, I got it for the red truck. What else did we buy in here? Oh, we bought some snuggle linen um, to sit around, make the house smell decent. Ooh, see? can't hold things with my hands you know the other morning my husband was home and we had a beautiful breakfast bacon and eggs and all that and I was lifting our dirty plates from the table to the counter I I just sat it on the counter and it was Corel and it smashed to pieces smashed so yes Corel does smash what else we got in the goodie bag here there's another one of those Snuggles. I don't think they're very expensive in the Dollar Tree or Dollarama. Sorry, uh, air fresheners, a dollar fifty. And I like I like the clean linen smell. We bought two more suets for the birds outside. And oh, it's just a suet nowadays. Bird food, a dollar fifty. I also bought cat milk, one, two, three, four, five. I bought five more cat milk for the kittens at $2 each. I've got it already put away. I uh, bought these professional paintbrush set, um, $3.50. I've bought some stain and I'm gonna play around with some uh, stain on wood and I just wanted some a nicer brush to brush with. So we'll try out those, see how they work. Uh, I saw this, it's a little pouring spout for your saucepan. So in the picture here, you kind of, it's, it's silicone, so you pop it on the side of your pot, you know, if you're making gravy or whatever, and apparently, oh, okay, so you pop it on like this, and you'll get a little pouring spout. We'll see how it works. It was something new. And it's called, uh, so it says pouring spout for saucepan, $1.25. So for $1.25, we'll try that out in the kitchen. They had some uh, cotton wool. I've used this before. Again, when you see the Lion Brand, grab it because Lion Brand is really good uh, yarn. I believe this is 60, yeah, 69% cotton, 31 acrylic. I bought it in this lovely green and white. Um, I thought it might blend in nice with the blanket I'm making, or I don't know, I'll make something else with it. Who knows? Who knows what Caroline will make with it? Did it say how much they were? 
So I believe yarn, yarn, yarn. Knitting yarn, four dollars each. And I mean, you would probably pay more than that at Michael's or wherever you buy your yarn at your local yarn shop. I saw these uh, goodies um, scrunchies. You actually get three in it. I went with the black, so there is three in there. Don't know why I took my glasses off. So they are by Goody Goodies Goody, and they're ouchless. <laughs> so what much price were they? I don't see them. They wouldn't have been very much. My receipt's huge. They were a couple dollars. Not very much at all. I grabbed uh, some brisk lemon iced tea. 87 cents still. I just grabbed two of those. And I found some more off the... Um, wreath hangers in white they also had black so depending on the color of your doors uh they had black as well i was so happy that they brought white ones back in again like i say my doors are metal so they just uh magnet on magnet on to each other so these were 275 each and i put something up here let me reach our last item i grabbed this little uh dog toy for RJ. We're putting it away for uh, Christmas. It's a squeaky toy. It's $4.25, like a little wiener dog. And uh, we're not going to squeak it because he's sleeping behind you all there. So anyways, that is the end of my Dollar Tree Dollarama haul. I'm just going to be right back because I did buy the kittens some uh, bowls and I want to show you them. So I bought them these cute little dishes. So uh, they were $2.50 each. I got two of this uh, really pretty bronzy color and two off the little purple color. So they have four. The price is right there, $2.50 each. They've been enjoying their food and their milk in them. So yeah. So I'll just, uh, I'll show you the snow outside and I'll catch us all on my next video. Take care, everyone. Bye for now. Hi everyone, I just want to show you that it is snowing here in Manitoba. It is Sunday evening, October 6th, and we're getting there for a snowfall. It's accumulating on the table and chairs there and on the deck. This is RJ's first time uh, seeing snow. Come on RJ, you can see him under the tree there. And I also just wanted to share um, the wreath that I made for Remembrance Day. Let's see if RJ will come up. Come on, RJ. RJ. He's very curious. There he is. Come on, RJ. Oh, oh. He's thinking about it. You coming in? RJ.